Ho! Everyone who thirsts, come to the waters. And you who have no money, come, buy and eat. Come, buy wine and milk without money and without cost. Why do you spend money for what is not bread, and your wages for what does not satisfy? Listen carefully to me, and eat what is good, and delight your soul in richness. Incline your ear and come to me. Listen, that your soul may live. And I will cut an everlasting covenant with you, according to the faithful loving kindnesses of David. Behold, I have given him as a witness to the peoples, a ruler and commander for the peoples. Behold, you will call a nation you do not know, and a nation which knows you not will run to you, because of Yahweh your God, even the Holy One of Israel. For he has adorned you with beautiful glory. Seek Yahweh while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. And let him return to Yahweh, and he will have compassion on him, and to our God, for he will abundantly pardon. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, nor are your ways my ways, declares Yahweh. For as the heavens are higher than the earth, so are my ways higher than your ways, and my thoughts than your thoughts. For as the rain and the snow come down from heaven, and do not return there without watering the earth and making it bare and sprout, and giving seed to the sower and bread to the eater, so will my word be which goes forth from my mouth. It will not return to me empty, without accomplishing what pleases me, and without succeeding in the matter for which I sent it. For you will go out with gladness and be led forth with peace. The mountains and the hills will break forth into shouts of joy before you, and all the trees of the field will clap their hands. Instead of the thorn bush the cypress will come up, and instead of the nettle the myrtle will come up, and it will be to Yahweh for his renown, for an everlasting sign which will not be cut off.